magical waters that can break this spell. But my old enemy has followed me here, and he means to stop this quest at any cost. The quest to discover the secret temple. Yesterday, the eagles continued to amass precious jewels. Three more gems brought their total to 35. The wolves added four more to their tally and now hold 22 in all. The tiger warriors have 20 gems, but have lost their comrade Hadab. Only two walk under that banner today. And the panthers trail the others with only 18 jewels. Thought, Lymel, you did well to collect the four jewels in time in Riddle Trap. Deathot, were you calm when you saw the walls coming towards you? Well, I was a little bit worried because I didn't know that they were going to move and they were moving in really quickly. But I think I managed to keep my cool well enough to get out. Lymel, how would you have felt if Deathot had been lost? I would have panicked because um, I don't think I can complete this quest on my own. I think I need Desolt there too. May this day be fruitful for you, young warriors. I wish you good fortune. Today, the warriors will be tested on their strength, accuracy, and agility as they face the 13th of the 14 tasks that await them under the burning sun of this mysterious land. So, let the day's challenges begin. Warriors, many centuries ago, these rocks were hurled to this place by a mighty volcano. Now, from these same stones, the rays of the sun will conjure the jewels you seek. But first, the broken towers that lie before you must be rebuilt here at the top of this mound. When the towers are complete, the sun will work its mysterious magic upon them. Be advised, to move them to their rightful place will take great strength and stamina. And it is these two qualities that are being tested today. If any of you are still striving to complete the task at the beat of the second drum, you will be punished for your weakness by the spirit that guards this place. Okay, so I think it's best if we start with the base for this. Okay, okay. Ready? ready? Yeah. Now without Hadath, Marsa and Sohar will gain two gems for each obelisk, but this task is made more difficult by the intense heat of this mysterious land. Gather in the jewels you seek, you must make your way carefully through the threaded pathway that lies before you now. But be wary, for if any of these cords are touched, a bell will ring, and the spirit guards that stand motionless here will be alerted, and they will act swiftly 
to punish your lack of agility. Do not let your mind wander as you walk this perilous path, my friends, or you will suffer the consequences and be removed from the quest. If I go first, I can make a pathway. Yeah, that's And a good if idea. possible, then I'll try and get any jewels that I can. OK, good luck. Don't take any okay. risks, OK? I don't think we should take any risks at all. Do you think you can get it? Highland, please, yeah. no. I don't think you should. I don't think you should. No, don't. Really, please don't. Please don't. You can get it. I'm so close now. I don't think you should. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. OK, try. Please do not ring a bell, OK? Which way should I get this? Think it out carefully. Careful! No, no, don't use your other hand. Just leave it if you can't get it. I don't think you should get that. Leave I, it. I can get it, I can get it. OK, but do you have to be very careful? So, so, so careful. Come on. Got it. You got, got it. it, well done. Yes. Despite the fears of Yeda and Karja, Taylan's determination has netted him a gem. But he must still carry it through the threads, under the watchful eyes of those who guard them. Is there anything above me? No. No. OK, keep going. It's be so careful. Oh, be so... Be really careful. You're really close to threads. Warriors, you see before you an uneasy pathway across this land. Just to traverse these stones requires agility enough. But to also gather the jewels along the way requires even greater skills of movement. Remember, do not let your desire for the jewels tempt you to risk too much in their taking. Indeed, some of the pouches contain no jewels at all. But also, do not be too timid in your ambition or you will leave this place with nothing. Wolves, prepare yourselves. You ready? Okay, I think that we should go for the slightly easier jewels rather than going really far out to the right and to the left. If we just try it might be the harder pouches to, it might be the pouches to harder to reach to actually contain the jewels. Okay, well, I think don't go out for the really far ones like them two there. Look for paths. Okay, okay. Put the gloves on. Yeah, you ready? Okay, now do you want to go first? Yeah, I'll go, I go first? first. I'll go first. Okay, remember, play it safe. Try not to go for jewels that are too hard to get. Unless you're sure. Okay, good luck, Lionel, well, you can do this. Thank you. Go. The wolves have a difficult task oh, no, ahead. No, that's not, that's not so many pouches, yeah, and they are only two. Okay. So steady feet, steady feet. Panthers, you must work together now to direct the force of this machine at the vessels yonder. For within these four urns, the jewels you seek lie ready for the taking. Aim well, my friends, and let your eye command the pace of your attack, not your arm. But avoid haste. For if you are too eager to destroy these vessels, then you will not only miss the jars themselves, but also your opportunity to succeed in this task. When the first missile is fired, a drum will sound. At the second beat of the drum, you must leave immediately, with or without the jewels. So, to the catapult, and prepare for the task ahead. Okay, I okay, think two ahead. people need to aim it, one person load it. Do you want a for her? Yeah, yeah, okay, let's yeah, get to it. Oh, quick, guys, quick. Eight. Open up. Open up, sir. It's in there nice. Okay. And pull right back. There you go. Okay, pull right back, that's it. Pull right back. Go right as fast. Oh. 
Aksu, Sonro and Yonro must find their range quickly if they are to succeed here. Go, 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 go. Knee down, knee down. So he gets the height. Oh, yes! yes. Well Tigers, Sohar and Marsa work hard under the watchful eye of the spirit guard. Marsa must make haste. Thanks, Sohar. The eagles are without Taylan, and the jewel he gained is lost. Yeda and Karja cannot afford to put a foot wrong. Kef, don't go back too far. Do you think I should go through there like that? I can go like that. I'm not sure, but try. I think you should just keep very low, keep it really low. Well done, well done, that was good. Going. Shall I crawl under and then all the way there and then go over? I think so. But be, you've got to be down really, really low. When you're by that bag, I'll come in. OK. Keep going. Oh, wait. Don't go know, too far I forward. I'm gonna... Be very careful. Do you think I should go there, then? Yeah, I think that's a better idea. Sorry, I don't worry. No, it looks okay from here, but probably when you're in there, there's lots. I'll go over and then crawl. Under, under, yeah, go under. But not now, but go over there, over here, and then over to here, where there's... Keep very careful. You've got to be really careful, you're really close. Well done, but keep low, keep low. Well done. OK. Do you want me to go for the jewel? I can get it. OK. Well done, well done. I'm going to start coming in, OK? OK, You on. just keep going. It's somewhere you go now, and then... Go up. Oh, oh, my God. God. That's it. That's right, pull. Okay, pull. Quick, we don't have much time. Okay, that's it, you pull back. Right back, Axel. Go down and fire. Yonra is still oh, the only close. panther to have felled a pot. In close. They must get more before the second drum sounds. Feel Nevar's presence? No, no demons neither. 
The world about me seems untroubled today, Raven. Good. And now that the eye has been destroyed, he will no longer know my movements. Maybe he will stay away long enough for us to complete the 14 tasks. Remember, when the warriors are at the Citadel, they will be safe for a while. Nevar cannot enter there. But on the journey back? They will be in great danger once again. Aye. You must find the Dark One and destroy him, Raven, or the mission will fail. Marsa is still struggling with her tower. Sohar has mastered hers and looks set to gain jewels. Okay. Karja has gained a second jewel. Well done. She must take care not to follow Talan. Come on. I'm going to try and get this jewel, OK? I don't think it's going to work. It's, I've got it. Karja has added another gem. Such skill. Um, I'll just go through the end and I'll help you, OK? OK. Just stay there. Let's see, yes. Come on. Am I going to touch anything? Um, hang on. Be careful. This be is a difficult testing task for Yida, who is now alone in the threads. Just be careful. Come on. Do I just crawl under you? Yeah, think? be careful. We're nearly there. What should I do on this last one? Don't go through the middle, because that's hard. Just go through one of the trees. Am I under? Yeah. Nope, I'm not in there. OK. OK, now slowly start coming up. Be careful, you're almost touching that bell. OK, now start, slowly start coming up. Slowly. I think that's easier for you. OK, here's the jaw. Well done. OK, so now step over. OK, be really careful. Crouch down. Careful. Am I over? Yes, you are. Okay. Keep down. Keep down. Yes. You did it. Well done. Well done. We've got three juice. She's good. Great. Eagles, you now have a difficult choice. Talan has been lost in the thrall threads. But Sacharani decrees that you may use eight of your hard-earned jewels to bring him back. But you must decide to keep the jewels or be reunited with Talan. I think we should, because yeah. in the end, a, a team member is more important than jewels, and we'll, yeah. if we get into the secret temple, we'll probably need him. And so he's a we, really good warrior. So should we bring him back? We'd like to bring back Talan. Very well. Then eight jewels are required. The eagles have 38 jewels, so we'll be left with 30. So be it. Welcome back. Thanks, guys. Oh, my God. Okay, don't worry. We've still got 30 jewels, guys. Well done, eagles. This way. It was so hard, and unfortunately, Taylan touched a bell, and so it was down to me and Karja to get through and get the rest of the jewels, which we did. So now we've got three more jewels for the eagles. Yeda and Karja, I'm so glad they brought me back. The eagle team spirit is definitely back now.
Desot is now a lonely figure. Lyamel is gone, and he must travel on alone. If he falters here, it will be the end for the wolves. Desot, Sacherani decreed that a warrior may be brought back once, but only once. That means Lymel is now lost from the quest, and you must proceed alone. Come. I said to Lymel before the challenge to try to play it safe, but she went for the jewels on the outside. I'm really upset that she's gone out because I'm on my own now, but I think I can do well in future challenges. That's a sunwell. Look. Well done. Yes, well done. Okay, go on, Axel. At last, Sonro has found his target, and the Panthers have now gained two gems here. That's it. Aim. English. Aim. Oh, oh that's close straight. Wrong way. Wrong way. So you have to pull it round through. That's it. <laughs> Both hands. Right down. Right down. Oh. Okay, mate, that's it. There you go. That's it. Remember, take your time to aim. I got it, guys. Come on, Sonia. Take your time to aim. Move back. Look at it. Oh, oh short. Right. Came out of it wrong. Okay. Right, pull to the left. Ah. Down to the left. So wait, wait, that's it, well done. It seems that the Panthers have lost their accuracy and time is running out. The second drum will soon sound. Hold that, right back. Hold that, bend. Fire, fire. Well yes. done. Woo. Another fine shot from Yonra, who has earned two gems this day. That's it, come on, Samuel. Close. Go on, Axel. Is it going? The pull. Get ready to flex myself just in case. Yes! Okay, okay, Axel, too, has scored a hit for the Panthers. The only team to have gained all four jewels from the catapult. I'm really glad that we got all four pots. It was really, really, really exciting. Eagles still lead, despite Taylan's fatal error at the Thrall Threats. He was brought back, and his team now have 30 jewels. The Tigers and Panthers both excelled in their tasks, each gathered in all four jewels. The Tigers have 24, and the Panthers 22. But the Wolves gained no jewels this day, and Lymel was lost when she slipped at the stepping stones. Leader Desot now continues alone with 22 gems. Did you act as a good leader by choosing to go last in the Thrall Threats? Would it not have shown a better example if you had gone first? I think looking back now, it would have been better if I had gone first because I'm quite small and I can fit into good places, so I could have worked out a path for everyone else. And if we did do that again, I would have gone first. Taylor, do you think it was clumsiness that caused you to be taken away? It was a stupid mistake, really. The reason I went in first was because during the first leadership challenge, Thrall Threads, I came first. So I thought that I might do better than the other warriors, but obviously not. Karja, when you faced the Thrall Threads in the leadership challenge, you did not do well. Do you think you've become a better warrior since then? I think I have because we've improved. We've all improved so far through all the 13 challenges we've done. I thought I did a lot better today. I wish you a restful night's sleep. You have a vital day ahead of you tomorrow.
Desert, you are now alone. And a lone warrior is a vulnerable warrior. What do you feel about that? Well, I'm worried in future challenges that I'm just on my own, but I think I'm a skilled warrior and that I can manage on my own. Do you think it was careless of Lymel to go the way she did? Well, I said to Lymel before the challenge to play it safe and go down the centre, and if you want to collect the jewels, then collect it down the centre. If she went out to the left or to the right, then it's her fault, and I did say not to. So, yes, I do think it was careless. Do you think you will survive in this quest? I think if I can carry on working well, then I will survive in the quest. Where do you think your leadership went wrong? as you have no comrades now? Or was it always your plan to proceed alone? Well, I don't think I had a plan and I didn't want to carry on alone. The reason my comrades have gone out is because they've been careless in their challenges and I tried to do my best and work well in the team and it's not my fault if they had out. Out of your three fellow wolves who started this quest with you, who do you miss the most and why? I don't miss anyone the most. I miss them all the same because they were all three of them good warriors and it's unfair if I miss one more than the other. I wish you well, Desert. You will need good fortune to be with you. Navar has outwitted me in the past. Yesterday I tricked him and now the battle is more even. He will be angry at having lost the all-seeing eye and will be planning his revenge, I am sure. But for the moment, he keeps his distance. And tomorrow, the warriors will complete the last of their 14 tasks. Then they must turn their gaze to the Citadel, where the final part of this quest begins. Next time on Raven, the Secret Temple, the pillars stand to be traversed by the Panthers. Will they summon the courage? Desert must face the challenge of archery alone, now that Lymel is lost. Yeda, Karja and Talan must summon their bravery to face the ledge while the Tigers must decipher the symbols of Rangoli Ring. This is the last of the 14 tasks. I must continue to keep Navar at bay to allow them to complete it. You must have done Raven's beard. I mean, that looked good. Well. <laughs> All right, welcome back to CBBC Office with Dan, Jeff, and the lovely Miss Catherine Walk, who is giving us a makeover courtesy of the Fashion Police. That's right. Hey, guys, earlier on we met two presenters, Dan and Jeff, who were in need of being presented with a whole new wardrobe. Yes, they were in dire need of a makeover, and fast. Huh. I don't need a makeover. You're wearing a sack, Jeff. That is true. We ask ourselves, is there a deeper reason for these guys' crimes against fashion? What? What? Well, every now and then, this, the, fa the fashion faux pas can indicate a deeper cry for attention. For example, we can look at Dan and see that deep down, he is indeed quite shy. Ha! <laughs> Dan! Shy?! Oh yes, he indicates the classic repressed personality syndrome. <laughs> He's shy. <laughs> of course, I'm shy. I understand it all now. It all makes so much sense. Jeff, I'm shy. Hey, Ori! Did you hear that? I'm shy! No, shy! Yeah, I'm a shy, retiring, delicate little wallflower! Ha! Oh, I feel so much better now. Another accurate diagnosis from Dr. Genius. And then we have Jeff. Oh, don't tell me. I wear checked shirts because my mummy didn't hug me enough when I was a child. No, Jeff. You wear what you wear because you are a negative person. Yeah. Now, you wear something on the outside that represents what you feel on the inside. Negativity. I'm not negative. There you go again. No, I don't. So negative. Right, hang on. So I can't disagree with you without proving you right. OK, I agree. I am negative. I am positively negative. Ah, oh, you admitted it. Right, I give up. Ah, but not in a negative way. Storming out positively. Dan, shall we watch Horrible Histories? Oh, with you? On my own? But I'm so very shy. I'm shy! <laughs> 
terrible Tudors, gorgeous Georgians, slimy Stuarts, small Victorians, woeful wars, ferocious fights, stingy castles, daring knights, horrors that defy description, cutthroat council, full Egyptian, vicious Vikings, cruel crime, punishment for a major times, Roman rock.